in February, uh, you announced that you would do a certain number. This was February 20th. And then in yes. March 17th, you withdrew that guidance, which yes. really did worry yes. people. Um, how do you assuage people? Because who the heck knows what's going to happen? Yes, I, I think you're right. One thing that I continually point out to others is that we have a very experienced management team, one that has managed and navigated through incredible cycles and disruption before, whether it was 9-11 or the great financial crisis. And we've always come out very strong. We have an incredible balance sheet and lots of strength and stability at Ventas and uh, we are, that is a, a factor that obviously is among the most important things to be able to manage successfully through unprecedented times like we're in now. And we're using all the strength that we have in our great team and our great operating partners to make sure that we are focused on having seniors, patients, residents, and our employees come out of this unprecedented pandemic in the best possible condition that they can. Okay, so uh, let's say um, I were with you. I know you've got a new person that you like very much has come in. I might say, you know what, Deb, let, why don't we take a break? We don't know what the spreading is going to be here. Maybe it's going to spread like wildfire. Let's just uh, suspend our distribution for now and come back when things are better. What do you say to someone like that? Which, by the way, because it's a, what, 1.2 billion. I mean, that's not an unreasonable thing to do. I dealt with two REITs this weekend that I was horrified that they did exactly what I just mentioned. But they said, what else should we, what else can we do, Jim? So how do you say to people, listen, uh, I'm going to pay it when maybe some people feel you should suspend it? Well, as I mentioned, we're in a very strong and stable financial condition. Our board just declared our normal quarterly dividend last week. I think we want to understand the full range of potential consequences here. And there could, as you know, be an upside surprise in terms of duration, a scientific cure. Uh, there's lots of financial uh, support that's being provided by policymakers. And so I think there is. A lot we don't know yet because we're in a strong financial condition and we understand the dividend's important. Our board made a decision uh, to declare the normal dividend and uh, we will continue to be responsible to all of our stakeholders. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.